<laughs> okay. <laughs> I think we are live. Let's see. Make sure that we're live online here. Okay. Ah, okay, here we go. So, okay, we are live. <laughs> Welcome everyone. Um, thank you so much uh, for joining us tonight. Um, for those of you uh, who are in the audience uh, watching us on YouTube Live, um, thank you very much for tuning in. Um, this is our first time doing this, uh, uh, Gold Thimble via uh, YouTube. Uh, we've always done this as a live show in the past. Uh, so this is a really exciting experiment for us, and um, I hope uh, this the technology holds up for us. Uh, but uh, we appreciate your patience, and thank you for uh, for for checking this out. We're excited to to present this show to you. Um, let me start by welcoming my co-host, uh, Miss Jackson. Uh, hi, Miss Jackson. Hello. Miss <laughs> Jackson is the vice chair for the Design and Media Arts Pathway, and my name is Joe Guerreri, and I'm the chair. Um, we're joined tonight by um, a bunch of our wonderful faculty and the students from our uh, fall 2020 Gold Thimble class. Um, let me start. I, we have a presentation that we wanted to share with you. Okay, so welcome. Uh, welcome, welcome everyone to the um, Gold Thimble Fashion Show. Um, I would ask uh, for everyone who's on the, the, the Zoom right now, if you could just be sure to mute your microphones uh, while, while we get underway. Um, so uh, this is uh, part of the Design and Media Arts Pathway. This is a show we do every, uh, every semester. Um, for those of you who are not familiar with the Design and Media Arts Pathway at LA Trade Tech, uh, it consists of six programs, um, digital media, visual communication, sign graphics, tailoring, fashion merchandising, and fashion design. And actually our fashion design program uh, has, is one of the oldest uh, programs at Trade Tech. Uh, we've been around uh, for about 100 years uh, since uh, we were the Frank Wiggins Trade School. And we are uh, very excited uh, to, uh, to be a part uh, of, the, um, of, of the, the future of Trade Tech. Um, and as part of that, we're really excited to announce that we are, uh, we are going to be moving into a new building. So um, while we're uh, facing challenges right now uh, with, um, with the pandemic and our students have worked so hard and our faculty have worked so hard um, to, uh, to, to um, work in a remote environment. We are uh, really excited to announce that we're gonna be moving into a new home um, in uh, 2025. Um, so uh, we wanted to share that with everyone here. Um, we've been really excited to be a part of uh, designing this uh, new building with some amazing architects and we've had great support from our uh, local administration and our district administration in um, having this new home uh, for our amazing program and our really talented students. So we're very excited about what the future has to hold for um, trade tech and for uh, our programs and for specifically our fashion design program. And so excited that we get to celebrate here with you guys um, the work of the students and, and the future um, that, uh, that they're building for us. So I wanted to tell you all just a little bit about the class. Um, the students in the Gold Thimble courses spend a semester producing a series of garments that demonstrates the skills they've acquired in the fashion design program. Uh, this semester, uh, students of course faced the additional challenge of actually having to do their work from home because of uh, the COVID pandemic. Um, so instead of having the regular access uh, to industrial machines uh, in our labs, 
students had to be really, really creative and set up workspaces in their homes. Um, and what really was outstanding was the incredible work uh, that the students produced um, in spite of these challenges. We were all really, really impressed with the work uh, you guys did. And uh, I'm, I'm really excited to share it with, with the audience. So just to tell you a little bit more about the show, um, as we were working this semester, and as you all know, um, the, uh, the situation here uh, in LA and in the country, um, you know, just became more and more uh, challenging. And we had hoped at the beginning of the semester that things might uh, get to a point where we would be able to um, have our, our fashion show in some um, uh, maybe in a, a different way, a different presentation, but we'd still be able to have an in-person show of some kind. And of course, we weren't able to do that. So we had to come up with a way for the students to still celebrate their work, um, but do it in a way that would be safe um, and that would, uh, would allow them to do it on their own. And so we decided that we would do a video presentation of the student work. And we asked uh, the students, um, to uh, create videos on their own. And we gave them some very strict guidelines uh, to make sure that they did these uh, very safely. Um, so we uh, required them to wear masks at all times, including the models. So when you watch these videos and you see the models um, doing the runway walk, you'll see that they're all wearing masks. Um, students had to maintain social distancing while working on their videos. And they were required to film outdoors or inside their homes with just one or two people at a time. So they would either film themselves in their home or a family member might uh, record them. So these were really, really challenging, uh, challenging uh, restrictions, protocols uh, that we put, put on them. And we weren't sure what we were gonna get to be perfectly honest with you. This was our first time doing it and we, we weren't entirely sure what, what would happen. And the results were really outstanding. We were really, really pleased to see um, what, what the results were. Um, and I think you'll be excited to see the, the great um, talent that, they, that they, they've shown. Um, so we're going to be screening three videos as part of the show this evening. The videos will be streaming live from our video conference. Um, you may see some lagging in the video. Um, it's just a, a function of uh, screening videos uh, over a, uh, a, a connection like this. Um, but we will be sharing the completed videos on YouTube immediately after the show this evening. So you will have access to watch them in, in a high resolution format. Um, so we'll share those links right after the show. Uh, so with that, we thank you again for joining us and we really hope uh, that you enjoy, enjoy the show. Uh, the first um, uh, part of the show, uh, the first video is going to be our designer collection. And so in this, each student was asked to put together a collection that consisted of swimwear, menswear, athleisure, children's, and avant-garde. So we'll begin with that video.
Great job, everybody. Um, how about the faculty? Any feedback from the faculty? Oh, I love it. Very well done. You know, um, I have to say, working at home is a challenge, but some of the fabrications that you guys had to do on your own, the chiffon, the swimwear, looks great. Very, very challenging, but you did a very, very nice job. Well done. Yeah, really, really outstanding. Uh, any any other faculty had any any comments? That you I really love that spiky dress. I was intrigued by how the um, they constructed that, and it was just gorgeous. And um, I loved it. Everything looked really good, though. I was intrigued by that one in particular. Yeah, I'm, really, I'm very really impressed. Good. I'm very, very impressed with mm -hmm. all this. You know, with this limitation, with uh, doing the COVID with limited machine and helps. It's really impressive. Thank you, everyone. I'm so happy with all of the students which many of them I know. Congratulations. Congratulations, yeah. So Very let's, nice job. Mm -hmm. <laughs> let's go ahead and um, let's give some, give out some thimbles. <laughs> so let's, uh, let's see here, I will share screen, sorry. Okay, so the first category is swimwear, and the bronze thimble goes to Ida Fernandez. Yay, Ida! <laughs> Ida, are you here? Ida, I haven't seen her name up. Didn't see her name up. Okay, yeah. well, congratulations, Ida. We'll make sure we get you your, your thimble, but your, your design is really, really nice. It's really uh, very interesting. Well done. Uh, so next we have silver for swimwear. And silver goes to James Kim. James wow, Kim. Wow, James. Great nice job. James, are you here? Hello. Yeah, he hey, is. James. Congratulations. Uh, good job, James. Thank you guys so much. Very yeah. interesting. What yeah. inspired this? I, I think the, the lines are really interesting. Mm -hmm. Um. So I was trying to find a way to kind of make a swimsuit that kind of hugs the hips in a way, but I wouldn't say I was, I had like a particular inspiration for it. I just kind of started draping with the fabric and I liked how the bra and the hip part kind of goes together. So very nicely done. Congratulations. Thank you. Well done. Well done. Very nice. And for gold, the winner is Lydia Johnson. Yay, Lydia. Congratulations. <laughs> Lydia, are you here? OK, well, we'll make sure Lydia gets her, her thimble. Congratulations. Very nice work. The next category we have is menswear. OK, so the bronze for menswear goes to John Yu. Wow, John. John, are you here? Hey, John. Yes, John. Nice job. Hi. Beautiful. Very good. Really nice job. I loved your videography too. It was really, really looked good. You had um, very interesting slow motion photography. I thought it looked great. Great work. Oh, thank you. Very, very nice. Like the zipper details. Nice. Very nice. And for silver, for menswear, the winner is Luciano Muller. Nice job, Luciano. Hey, thank you, guys. Nice. Thank you. I mean, um, I'm really honored to get this, this thimble. I want to thank it to Mr. Alcala that was very patient to us. And you guys saw the faculty. It was like very attention to us, too. Thank you so much. Good job. Great work. Thank you. Thank right. you. Thank you. For gold, the winner for menswear is Donna Fernando. Yay. Wow. Nice work, Donna. Beautiful job. Well, thank you very much. Great Donna, work. Very pretty. I want one in a size 40. <laughs> <laughs> very nice. Thank you, Donna. Okay, and next up we have. 
Athleisure. Okay, the bronze for athleisure goes to Luciano Muller. Luciano, again, great job, uh -huh. Luciano. Thank you, guys. Thank you so much. I really appreciate it. Very nice. Very nice, very nice work. Mm -hmm. Can I ask you, is this a special print you all, uh, you, you had it made or it is a... Is a yeah, I have, I, have, I have a friend that he has a textile store in New York and oh, uh, wow. sem last semester uh, he sent me, I draw what I wanted and he, sent, he made it and he sent it to me. Uh, it, it, was really, it, was, it was really hard to match the lines and the uh, pants, but I could match the patterns on, uh, on a little jacket. So that made it a little bit nicer. Mm. Yeah, I like the oh. front of the pants. Thank you. Very nice lines. Mm -hmm. And for silver, the winner is Maritza Lopez. Well, Maritza, yay. Yay, Maritza. Yay, nice Maritza. work. Maritza, oh, yay. Good job. Maritza, are you here? Great. Yeah, I think she, I saw her. Yeah, she's here. Very nice. Great. Well, congratulations, Marissa. And we have a gold for athleisure. The gold goes to Lydia Johnson. Mm. Going to Lydia, nice, is a nice work, Lydia. Very nice. Very nice pants with the pin tops. Very nice. And next we have children. The bronze for children goes to Ida Fernandez. Oh, so cute. Oh, yes. <laughs> Ida, are you here? So adorable. <laughs> Ida's not here. That mom was so cute. I know, this little girl was so adorable. Is great. And for silver, Umberto Gomez. Umberto. Oh, How pretty. Umberto. oh, yeah. Very fashionable. Very yeah. nice. Very nice. And for gold for children, Christiana Schultz. Mm. Oh, that's nice. nice. Nice work. You're kidding. Wow. <laughs> <laughs> <No>. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. I did Good it. job. <laughs> Hi. Hi, everybody. Hi. <laughs> That's really funny. Thank you. Congratulations. <laughs> I was the no, because when I saw this, I was like, oh, no, no way. Let me just keep talking to Bam Bam, who's on, who's watching on FaceTime with me, by the way. Oh, oh, Bam Bam oh. says hello oh. to Miss Bam. Hi, Miss Bam Bam. Bam. Hi, say hi to me. <laughs> oh, please. <laughs> <laughs> Congratulations, it's really cool. Thank you. <laughs> nice job. Like the, yeah, the color. What? I know, thank you. <laughs> All right, and avant garde. For avant garde, the bronze goes to Donna Fernando. Very okay. nice. Very nice. Very nice. Thank you so much. Great work. Very nice. I wanted to ask you, what is the fabric at the top, at the shoulders, the structure? Satin, satin and inside a uh, macrum. Oh, to support. Mm -hmm. Yeah, looks good. Very nice. pretty. Very, yeah. The silhouette is gorgeous. Mm -hmm. Thank you so much. Congratulations. Congratulations. Okay. Um, For silver, Luciana Muller. Oh, oh wow, beautiful. Wow, that's yeah. really cool. That's nice. Thank you guys. <laughs> Thank you guys. It's so funny. Thank you guys. I really appreciate it. <laughs> Very pretty. And the gold for avant garde mm. goes to Bianca Dexter. Oh Bian yeah, I can wow, tell Bianca. Bianca. Yes. Nice, Congratulations, Bianca. Oh wow. Yeah. Bianca, are you here? Beautiful. Yes, she's here. I saw her. Yeah. yeah. Very nice. Very nice. Very Congratulations. Bad. Congratulations. Thank you. I worked really hard on this one. It shows. Very good. Yeah. Really. No, Bianca, that is absolutely phenomenal. You put your foot in that. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> well, 
Um, how did you do the spikes? Um, I had to punch holes into the fabric and screw them all in. <laughs> wow. What are they made of? They're two inch, I don't know, stainless steel, aluminum. Oh, okay. They have screws on the back. So I had to punch holes in the fabric and screw them in with a screwdriver each one. Oh my and gosh. How long did that take? It took probably two days to do the studying. Wow. And it's quite heavy with all the spikes. So you must have some sort of support with the quilt. Yeah, I have support with the quilt. It was extremely heavy. And the yeah. hardest even cutting out the pattern because I had to make sure that all the spikes were like even and everything. Mm -hmm. It was it was a task. Beautiful. The bag is nice. It's very stunning though. You did an amazing job with the spacing. It's it looks really good. Yeah. It's very nice. I love you guys. I miss you. <laughs> <laughs> we miss you too. <laughs> oh yeah, you are in. You are out of. Yeah, no, Bianca, that is like a Lady Gaga performance piece. You really <laughs> like I it is it is stunning. <laughs> Thank you. I call it my social distancing dress. <laughs> <laughs> oh, yeah. That's right. With okay. this one. <laughs> yeah, exactly. That's great. Really? Okay, so next up is evening wear. So let's we'll go ahead and switch over to that video. Sorry, folks, technical challenge here. Let's make sure I have this right. Just a second. Try this one more time.
Great job, everybody. Great job. Any comments uh, from uh, from the faculty? Well, I get the PowerPoint back up. <laughs> <laughs> I just have to put again, put my hat off to you guys for this. I, I can't imagine how difficult it was actually to pull evening wear off um, on your own. Um, it just is a really a testament to your skills and to your chutzpah and to your tenacity and everything else about you. You guys are going to make it. Um, I have no doubt whatsoever. I totally agree. Totally agree. Thank you, guys. Thank you. Thank you. Okay, so uh, let's give away some symbols. So for evening. We got some winners. <laughs> the bronze goes to Ooh. Luciana Muller. Hey, another one. Thank you guys. Appreciate it. Nice job, Luciana. Very nice. Thank you. It fits her perfectly. Yeah, I was yeah. impressed there was <laughs> no like gap. <laughs> yeah. I was impressed there was no back gap back there. It was very well fitted, very well done. Thank you. What, what mm -hmm. is the material you use, Louisiana? That is, is a, that is a stretch velvet. Oh, ah. Nice, it's hard to handle too. You did a good job with the black uh, men's jacket too. Velvet, yeah. velvet is very thank you. Thing to sew. Thank you, thank you very much. Very nice. Beautiful at the hem. All right, for silver in the evening category, Winner is Bianca Dexter. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, I love that. Bianca, Bianca that's cool. I love that. that. You carry yes. on. Bianca, yeah. are you here? Very distinct style, very distinct. I knew that was you when I saw it. Gorgeous. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Thank you. Bianca, I noticed you have like a kind of a, a brand, like the, the little aliens. Well, my, yeah, my theme for the whole collection was ancient aliens. Oh, cool. Okay, okay. Neat. Yeah, I was gonna say that looks like an alien medieval goddess. <laughs> so, like, that's perfect. Yeah. yeah, I made those alien heads out of clay, and then I made a mold and did them out of resin, and then silver leafed them all. So it was it was a lot of work. Wow! Wow! <laughs> that's <laughs> incredible. Put them all on. Yeah, and then I. You, <laughs> you need to come teach a class on that. <laughs> The little crystals are UFOs. I don't know. If that oh, no kidding. Oh, wow. <laughs> Very cool. Beautiful. Bianca. Beautiful. Great job, Bianca. Thank you. And the winner for the gold category is, I mean, the, for the, the winner of the gold for the evening category is Umberto Gomez. Oh, wow. Nice job. Nice, yeah. nice job, Very Umberto. Nice. Very nice. Mm -hmm. Umberto, are you here? He's not here. Oh, yeah, okay. Well, it's beautiful, beautiful work. Beautiful. Very, very nice. Oh, is is that the peacock thing? No. Mm. Okay. Well, our final category for the evening is actually inspired by an opera. Um, this was something that the faculty selected, and so for those of you who aren't who are new to our Gold Thimble Show, every semester um, the faculty pick a theme. Um, and this semester, they decided they wanted to try something um, theatrical. So they, uh, they decided to go with the opera, uh, Akhenaten, um, which is a, an opera that was um, originally written um, by Philip Glass. It was composed by Philip Glass in 1983. Um, it is about the life of the Egyptian pharaoh Akhenaten. Um, the revival played in London in... Uh, in 2019, and then it came to the Met in 2019, 2020 season. And the students watched videos from uh, the Metropolitan Opera uh, version. And that inspired the next uh, category, uh, the, the, the theme uh, for, for their garments. Um, so uh, without further ado, we'll go ahead and take a look at Akhenaten.
this stuff at home <laughs> it's just so incredible um, it's really really impressive um, let me go ahead and pull up our powerpoint So what was really interesting to me was taking a look at these images and seeing how, um, how wonderfully the students um, captured um, the, the, the look, the, the aesthetic of, of the show. Um, it, it was really, really quite, quite impressive. Okay, so for our final category, uh, theme category, the bronze goes to Michelle Fernando. Congratulations. Michelle, are you here? Yes. Yes, I am. Thank you so much. It really means a lot. Good job. Wow. Yeah, really, really nice. What is the top part made of? This top part around here, around the neck? It was actually a pleather. Um, and the black one was a sateen. And I used it on top of buckram. Nice. Wow. Thank you so much. So did you, um, the buckram is under the leather as well? Yes, it's sort of like sandwiched in between them. I see. Mm -hmm. The structure is really wow. nice. Thank you. Yeah, and I need to thank all of my professors and everyone for helping me get this award. Thank you. Oh, welcome, student. Thank you for your hard work. Thank you so much. Okay, for silver, the winner is Humberto Gomez. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, very nice. Yeah. Very nice. Humberto, is Humberto here? No, he's not here, right? Mm -hmm. I loved what he did with the, uh, 
the way he put the the beads and the the jewels on the, on the very nice yeah it's a lot of work okay and the gold for theme category goes to Ramona Vasquez. Wow. Oh, no, Ramona. Wow, that is amazing. That was very impressive. Oh. Ramona, are you here? Yes, she is. I think Ramona was. Ramona. Are you out there? <laughs> well, I think it was really, really beautifully done. So interesting. A lot of work. Yeah, a lot yes. of work. Yeah. All of these. <laughs> All of them. Thank you. Oh, you're welcome. Thank you. Thank you, Mr. Alcala. Very nice work. Ms. Duarte. We're getting a little echo, a little feedback, but very good work. Well, that takes us to the end of our show. Um, I just want to thank everyone for joining us. And um, I just, I want to thank um, Mr. Alcala and, and Ms. Duarte. They're, uh, hard work and perseverance as the instructors for this course. Um, uh, Mr. Alcala teaches the uh, 141 and 142 class where they uh, produce the garments and Ms. Duarte um, teaches the uh, 147 class uh, where they uh, actually do the gold thimble production. And uh, they were uh, incredibly, um, uh, they uh, worked very hard to, uh, to make sure that um, the students had uh, the best experience they could under the circumstances. And uh, I, I, I was so impressed by the, the quality and the, the, the level of the work that they were able to produce uh, doing this online, which is not easy. No, no. Very <laughs> so, nice. Well done. Nice. And, and I also want to uh, congratulate all of the faculty, all of the fashion design faculty who um, have gone through last semester and this semester doing all of this teaching online, you guys are, are outstanding. Um, and uh, I know it has been, it has been a, 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 real, uh, a real struggle to, to try to um, adapt and, and learn to do this uh, remotely and um, somehow you've done it. <laughs> so congratulations and, and thank you all for everything that you've done. And of course, to our staff, um, to, to, the, to Tessie, uh, who's been just an amazing support to us through the pandemic and I uh, also want to thank Roxanne Romo, who has uh, always been so supportive of, of, of us and the show. And then, of course, our, our administration, um, uh, Cynthia, our dean, um, John Valencia, our VP, and uh, Katrina Vanderwood, our, our college president, for, uh, for supporting us and trying to help us uh, figure all this out. And also our district administrators for always supporting us. I, I saw um, uh, Jeanette Gordon was uh, watching uh, the show. and. Um, she's always been a big supporter and come out to see us. So, so thank you to the district administrators. And of course, to our outstanding students who just yes. were incredible. Thank you guys so much for all of your hard work to have to do this from home and then try to learn to be videographers overnight. <laughs> and you did such an incredible job. Uh, it really, it really was great and fun to watch. So thank you guys so much. And I just want to make one plug. <laughs> we have classes. So if you like what you saw and you want to do this, sign up. We have a lot of classes. We have classes available in winter starting in January. And then we have our spring semester starting in February. So please visit uh, LATTC.edu and um, uh, register. Um, we've got great instructors uh, and uh, we would love to have you. So thank you all so much once again for joining us, uh, for tuning in and, and for, for watching the show. Um, we really appreciate it, and we hope you have a very, very happy holiday season. Take care and stay well. Good night, everybody. Good night. Good night. Good night. Good night. Congratulations. Bye. Good, Good night and congratulations to everybody. Good night. Oh, congratulations. Beautiful. Job. Congrats to you all. Congrats. Congratulations. Bye, everybody. Bye. 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 Great job. Bye. Congratulations.